Hello, welcome to the Chip Off the Old Block Toys. I'm Jeff here and today is going to be day seven of the 2021 LEGO Advent Calendars. All right, well, we've come a long way. Uh, you know, six out of uh, 24, and that is one fourth of the way, so we're starting at number seven, so we're a little bit more than 25% done. I'm really happy about this. And if you guys are happy about this video and like it, hit the like button, or on Rumble, hit the Rumble button. All right, so far we've got a Christmas bus, car wash, entrance to the North Pole, a hockey player that doubles as a cop, and we've got Santa's a little sleigh here and a little cop car. All right, let's see what's behind door number seven here on the city one. And it looks like we got another hockey player. So now the cop won't be playing with himself. He'll just say he'll have someone to play hockey with. And was that a Freudian slip? I don't know. You'll have to decide. But here we go. It's a female hockey player who has a double-sided head. She's got a mask on there so she can rob something. And this, a regular woman's face. So she may be the arch nemesis of the cop playing hockey with him in more than one way. And in hockey and in on the job. Anyway, let's go ahead and let's get her all dolled up. Not really. We're just putting skates on her, but that's okay. Oh. And then she's got a jewel in her hand, so again, I'm not sure if that's from the robbery or if her boyfriend just proposed to her. You'll have to decide. I don't really know. But, uh, you know, I could have gone a little further with that, but I try to keep this family friendly, so I'll just leave it there. And then, so now, what you see here, and these characters never stand up because there's no studs or anything to hold them up, so I just do the best I can here. So now, we've included a female hockey player who's also got a red ruby in her hand. And that's it for the city, so let's move on to Star Wars. After all, Star Wars is... Well, City and Star Wars is tied for my favorite themes. But, so far, we've got the targets that keep falling. Every time I move this, the Razor Crest, Z95 Headhunter, uh, the cannon for the Snowtroopers, a transport, and we've got a, a Stormtrooper. I almost said Snowtrooper, but it's not. Stormtrooper. Door number seven today is going to be another vehicle that I don't know. Wow, Star Wars? I thought I knew Star Wars. I guess I don't know Star Wars, guys. It kind of looks like a tank. Like the ones for the droids, uh, the battle droids, but you know what? I'm going to say like I always say, don't quote me on that, because I really don't know. But I can tell you, I like these little gifts, and I like how these things are priced. These things are priced pretty fair, uh, considering what you're getting out of them. So... Okay, that, that does not make any sense whatsoever. Okay. Well, I kind of wish they had more than just a single instruction to put this whole thing together because sometimes you really got to kind of stare at this for a second and wonder what the heck they're trying to tell you, which, you know... I See, I, I don't even... I don't know. Do we have a translator around here? I need a translator. I don't understand this. Alright, now on the back end of this it goes this and this. I think we're going to have a few of these tiles left over, which I really like this color. Um, the medium blue Lego color is really pretty and there's a lot of uses for it in the city, so couple extra tiles wouldn't hurt and I, and I won't certainly won't complain all right oh I see what it is now well they put it backwards in the picture they probably did that because you wouldn't be able to see what the heck it was um, like how to build it I'm sorry and uh, doing it this way you know it is so you know Luke's land speeder looks a lot like this except for its tan 
So this is just a Luke Skywalker speeder, and they only put it on one side. I'm going to go ahead, since I got another one, and give it a full windshield, since there's probably going to be a passenger, and I'm sure he don't want no dust and sand blown in his face when they're riding around and joyriding. So there you go. All right. So that is day seven for Star Wars. Let's do a little shuffle around here and get these pieces all, these calendars all moved around. And then we'll start day number seven on the Avengers. And I really kind of hate to say it, but the Avengers is turning out to be my least favorite calendar because it's just not very Christmassy. And it looks like we got Spider-Man. Now, I have to change my opinion. I just, I, I opened my mouth just a little too soon because my one daughter loves Spider-Man and I know that she would really enjoy um, this right here. So I'm going to revise that. It, it's quickly becoming, uh, it's rising on the charts here by including Spider-Man. And it's just a very simple little thing of Spider-Man. Here we go. And if you don't believe me, he's Spider-Man. Let's flip him around so you can see the back. He's He's even carrying his own logo on there. All right. So that's day number seven for the Avengers calendar. Now let's get to the last one for the day, and that is going to be a Harry Potter. You know, it just seems so weird. I remember when Harry Potter came out. Man, it makes me feel old. Well, I kind of am. But anyway, well, I said I'm getting there. All right, so let's, uh, door number seven is going to be a sign of sorts. I can't read it just yet. So let's, um, let's crack this one open. All right. I kind of like this signage. I might have to copy this. The Leaky Cauldron is what it's called. All right, just a simple little sign here. I actually like it, like I said. I'm going to actually uh, employ this in part of my uh, city. And number seven goes right there on that circle. It won't stay. Of course, I'm not really helping that process either. So there you go. And we got a leftover little bar here. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. I did. I do like today's gifts. The... Uh, Land speeder for Star Wars did throw me for a loop, but I do like it. I do like the color of it versus the, the uh, tan one that was in uh, A New Hope. The light blue one is a nice color. Um, of course, blue is my favorite color, so I, I mean, I am biased on that. So, if you guys like this video and you like the gifts today that Lego put out, please uh, drop a like on YouTube, Rumble over on Rumble. And regardless of what platform, if you haven't subscribed, quit being stubborn and just subscribe. And uh, if it's your first time here, you're not being stubborn. But please, subscribe. I'd appreciate it. And uh, leave me a comment below. Love to hear from you guys. Love to hear any holiday traditions you have, that kind of thing. Love to talk about that. Um, we had some holiday traditions, which in the next coming videos I will discuss. And um, also turn on all notifications. That way you'll hear from me just about every day. And yeah, I can talk that much. But uh, yeah, if you like my little dad jokes I throw in there and everything, I appreciate that. And guys, uh, if you need pieces for your mods and mock, I have a store over on BrickLink. The link's in the description. The store's called a chip off the old block. And it has about a million pieces. We're just a little under that right now. But uh, if you head over there to the link, uh, get your pieces fast. And uh, guys, whatever you do out there and gals, be safe out there. Be sure you're good to each other. And I will catch you on the next video.